guys thank you so much for stopping by at my channel and today I am having another review of the hotel uh, because I would love doing it every time I stay in each and every country I visit so anyone who would choose it or book it they would know what to expect in advance based on watching my honest and honest um, authentic review so today i am going to share with you and show you around um, of, of the hotel room which is located in jumeirah beach um, dubai and the hotel called amaj rotana and i believe this uh, hotel is a true gem because of first of all because of the location second of all because of the view that i got from my room it's really incredible i'm going to share it with you uh, third one is because of the stuff, the service, the hospitality from anyone that I am encountering to um, get a chance to deal with. Everyone is so oh, oh, heartwarming, welcoming, and really, really friendly. And it really, it really makes a difference. I'm gonna get, give you at the end some cons, but um, towards on how many, um, how many pluses. I think it's just. I mean, in terms of how many pros, I think the cons at this point will just fade away, but stay till the end. So I'm gonna share with you some cons and you have to watch the entire video before that. So let's dive in. Thank you. Guys, I just wanted to give you um, a 360 view from my balcony. Once again, for example, last night, there was a huge party right down below and to be honest i think it was russian party because all the music was russian um i did not like it but i could barely hear it in my room if i would close it and here it is i can show it to you from the glass of my window anyway okay guys let me start all the way from the beginning of the room here is the door um, should I show you how it is outside the hallway? Okay, this is the hallway. And let me show you the room. Um, as soon as you walk in, you will see the bathroom. Um, it looks just like this. This is a glass door of the shower. At the shower, we're going to have um, all three options. Um, obviously branded by the hotel. Shower, conditioner, and... Um, shampoo. Um, the shower settings are very standard, nothing really um, too advanced, but it's standard and I love it. So there's a mirror, um, two type of mirrors, one for where you can see your pores and all the details of your skin and the second one is just a regular. Here it is, we have vanity. So this hotel would offer you two um, robes which are really nice quality I have to admit that also they offer um, a body cream or lotion there's also some little like kit settings which would be um, just like a shower head and they would offer some um, toothpaste and a toothbrush just like very some very little basic which is really nice so here we have a standard a safe deposit box, um, a closet is pretty standard. I noticed that in Dubai they off always offer iron, always for some reason, which I never see in any European countries or even in the US. So at this time, because for one day I was staying with my sister, so I got two, um, this is two queen size beds, right? And as you see, it's a nice size. I love the sheets. They're actually nice quality. And look at the TV. TV is huge, even though I never watch TV, but it's nice settings. And look, they welcome you with your name on it. The local time of the country that you came from, which would be me, New York, United States. I mean, it's, it's no, it's actually, sorry, it's a local time over here in Dubai, but they put it in, in the convenient settings for you, which would be from United States, because it, if they use European time, it will be 2041 right now, but they're putting it 8.41 PM, so which is, I love it, absolutely really nice. 
so nothing too much extra or clutter i would say they have um obviously this would call i would call this working station um so i've been doing some work over here which was very convenient um so right over here we got some nightstands they also offer you actually let me go back here guys i'm gonna tell you a little bit about mini bar a little bit a little bit messy i apologize so but they offer you just um two bottles of water which would be this size and it's glass only actually i noticed that dubai only offering and using glass for the bottles every hotel we stayed in it was always glass so i'm glad that they're trying to to use uh, less plastic which is big big plus um and i would say right here they have just a refrigerator um which you can which is nice you can keep any any items there if you did some grocery shopping um so nothing really to to anything um, um extraordinary but i love it much more compared to the hotel where we stayed previously which was ritz I believe it's so overrated and it's getting really old and um, in terms of like vibe in terms of style so it's kind of like for old generation people i would say now this is the best part look at this guys just look at this view isn't it incredible today is a quiet night uh, but during the weekend saturday sunday they had a party right over here in this area there's a lot of loud music but to be honest i was so tired so i really did not mind i heard it a little bit with the even with the closed window but i did not mind so here they have two chairs and little table coffee table and i just can't get enough of this view guys i hope you feel the same i know it's really dark but i'm also gonna touch a video another video of this view which would be a during the day in the same um, review so you get the idea hi guys so I have a reason why I turn camera this way so I can face to you and explain why I'm doing this um, the reason I just wanted to explain to you why this wheel currently is off and there is a big um, story big reason behind that I believe it's been off for the past two three for the past two three months and they have a big reason for it so i've been reading that this uh, dubai eye or the wheel um by being inspired from london eye obviously and they wanted to compete with them so they make it they made it so much bigger obviously but the thing is they put it on this island which was built artificially it's not a mainland as Jumeirah Beach right here. It's been built artificially and they built it too fast. So they built it, built it too fast. They didn't let it, they did not let it settle. And what happened is this wheel, this Dubai Eye right now is so heavy. And while it was operating with tourists, every time it will do the spinning, um, it would create a vibration for the entire island. And so all of these residents who lives in this exclusive apartments actually quite expensive they have been complaining to the government to the state that they can't live like this so that's the exact reason why it's been stopped operating and right now they're trying to figure out how to fix the problem so obviously it is too heavy and let's see what they're gonna come up with and how they're gonna fix this I hope you're gonna learn something from this video otherwise Thank you so much for watching it. I am here to give you, to finish my tour for the room and I hope you really enjoy watching it. Guys, once again, thank you so much for watching this review. I hope it was really helpful and I hope um, every time you search for this hotel, you can get and click on my review before booking it so you can get the idea about the, the, the size of the room, the view and everything else. I just wanted to let you know that this whole, this room is not the cheapest one because it's two queen size beds and they got sea view. So it's quite um, higher than the regular price. I'm not sure how much, uh, but um, you know, there's a few levels of the rooms that you can choose from. So this particular one is on the 10th floor. Uh, if you're curious, um, I assume there's even higher floors. I mean, not, I'm not assuming it's, it's for sure there's higher floors. 
um, as high as 24th, 25th floor, uh, which is probably even more beautiful. Um, but I was, I was very happy to where I am right now and I'm really happy that there's two queen size beds. And as I said be before, there's only one con that I had to mention to you guys. Um, so otherwise, I hope you enjoyed my review. And thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Please don't forget to subscribe, like or dislike because it will be really helpful for me and it will inspire me to uh, film more videos like this for you guys. Thank you so much and I'll see you next time. Thank you.